Kashikola noted that there is disunity among more than 8,000 refugees and asylum seekers at the camp. Expected of you to live in unity, peace and harmony as brothers and sisters, irrespective of your background. Refugees are granted status based on their claims and not on their tribal or ethnic lines. The ministry is reliably informed that some of you are trying to promote tribalism and ethnicity in the settlement, and this must come to an end. It, this is unacceptable, and the ministry will not hesitate to cancel or withdraw refugee status of those found to promote tribalism and ethnicity in the settlement and send them back to their countries. Kashikola also warned local farmers and businesses against exploiting refugees with cheap labor or non-payment. Commissioner of Refugees, Venatius Nuyoma, called for an end of worldwide conflict to help end displacements of persons. In order to reverse this trend, it is incumbent upon leaders of all corners of the world to proclaim together that enough is enough, more innocent lives have been lost, conflict must end. Osiri Refugee Community Committee Chairperson Martin Biendimbwa commended the government for its continued protection of refugees and asylum seekers. We thank the government for the protection provided for both refugees and asylum seekers, particularly in Osiri and in Namibia in general. Moreover, as the refugees and asylum seekers continue to benefit from both health facilities and as well as education, as they still living in Namibia, we vividly extend our gratitude to the government in this manner. The day was celebrated under the theme, whoever, wherever, whenever, everyone has a right to seek safety. Faith Sankwasam, NBC News, Osiro Refugee Camp, Ochozonjupa.